Hello everyone and thanks for hanging out with us for Live in the D in the Green Room where we give you a quick recap of our show today and someone got to speak with someone very special earlier this week. Yes, I got a chance to speak to Dolly Parton. It's ahead of her new Christmas special called Magic Mountain Christmas. It's yeah. so cool. You get to hear her sing. She shares a couple of new projects she has in the works as well. Yes. Take a look at the segment. And her gorgeous Christmas tree. <laughs> True. <laughs> Dolly Parton is going to be back on TV tomorrow night right here on NBC for a special called Dolly Parton's Mountain Magic Christmas, which has a slew of guest stars as well from Jimmy Fallon to Willie Nelson. I had the chance to talk with Dolly yesterday about that and other projects she has in the works. Dolly Parton, thank you so much for taking the time to join us today. And we're talking about your Magic Mountain Christmas special. You have a ton of guest stars. What can fans expect from this show? Well, you can expect to have a lot of fun. You're going to be well entertained because we, as you said, have some of the greatest people like Willie Nelson, Molly Cyrus, Jimmy Allen, Jimmy Fallon, Billy Ray Cyrus, and Zach Williams. That's the lineup of our singing guests. And then, of course, we have many great actors like Tom Everett Scott, Anna Gastar, and my little nephew, Liam, who's playing the elf, and Angel Parker, and girl playing my best friend, Judy, is Rhoda Griffiths. So uh, we're excited about all the, sh the people that are on doing all the great work that they're doing. It's a show within a show, as you've heard, where we kind of show what it's like to put a show together with all the things that might go wrong and will go wrong and just trying to pull it all together to get it done on time. Yeah, and a lot of singing too. Uh, your voice sounds amazing in the special. Now, we are also talking about the holiday event you have planned with your goddaughter, Miley Cyrus. Uh, you guys are hosting New Year's Eve together. Tell us a little bit about what we can look forward to with that. Well, we Molly was on my show, as I mentioned, and we had time to kind of visit. And I knew she was doing that New Year's Eve show. And she said, you're going to have to do that with me sometime. I said, well, how about this time, since we've kind of got all this good energy going together. And so she said, that would be great. So then she went back and told NBC that we were going to do it together. And so I'm looking forward to that. We're, that's out of Miami. And we're going to be probably wearing about 10 different outfits, doing little skits, doing some hosting, doing some singing. And Lord only knows how we're going to look, what we're going to do. But it's going to be fun. You know, Molly, she's going to spice it up and I can't let her get ahead of me. So I'm going to be trying be right on her coattail, trying to live up to her. <laughs> No, and I, I will say that was a lovely moment with you and Miley in the in the special as well. You have done a lot about Christmas all all throughout your career. Um, what do you love so much about this time of year? Well, I really just love Christmas for what it stands for. Of course, being from Christian uh, base, you know, we always celebrated, you know, Christ, the Christmas. And even if whether or not you're, you're, that is your faith, everybody loves all the great Christmas songs. And all my Jewish friends, all my people, the other religions, they still love those songs singing along with all that. So we did a lot of the favorite Christmas songs. But for me, I just love the, the joy of it, the family, the giving, the respect receiving the colors, the food, the music, everything about Christmas I love. And so being able to do something from home, from Dollywood in my Smoky Mountain, uh, Mountain Magic Christmas and having all my special guests come there for me to host them at Dollywood. We love the park and we got to let Dollywood star a little bit because of all their talent, the dancers, the singers, and just the place itself was a magnificent place to put a show together. Yeah, it really looked very magical. And you were recently recognized by being inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. What did that occasion mean to you? <laughs> well, I was surprised, as you remember, back when I heard that I was going to be inducted, I wasn't sure, not knowing all I I came to know about it, that it was also for people that had influenced other people, you know, in, in other fields of music and other things. But at the time, I just always thought the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame would be for people that had worked as hard as I have in country music to get into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame if that was their music. So when they convinced me that I had earned it, I said, well, if they put me in, I will certainly uh, accept it gracefully and be humbled by it. So they put me in anyway. So certainly I went, even wrote a song about it for it, just to kind of little tongue in cheek kind of thing. And so 
uh, it was a great honor, really. And I'm going to be doing a rock album because of it, because I'm not going to let that go to waste. I thought I'd often thought about doing a rock album because my husband loves rock and roll music best. And so timing was everything. So it's come out next fall. I'm going to have a rock and roll album. Oh, that's very called cool. Rockstar. <laughs> Rockstar. I like that. Uh, giving back is another huge part of this time of year and something that's very important to you. Your philanthropic work is well known and was recently recognized by Jeff Bezos, who gave you $100 million to distribute. What are your plans for that? Are we going to see a lot more books? Well, it's certainly generous of Jeff Bezos and uh, to offer that to me because he said he had seen what I'd been doing over the years and he knew that I would spend it wisely. And he's right. I will definitely spend every dime of that for some wonderful cause to help some needy causes, people to help uplift people and do the right things. And I always let my heart lead me into what they're going to be. And I haven't started spending it yet because I'm studying on where and how and what all I do want to do with it. But you can bet that I'll be doing good things for good people with that money and thank him for that. Well, thank you so much for taking the time to be with us today. And I hope you have a wonderful holiday season. Well, thank you. Be sure and watch the show December yes. 1st, eight o'clock. Well, that was really cool and staying yes. with the holiday Christmas theme. Exactly. We had the Motown Museum gift shop in, and you got a chance to see some, everything from like ornaments to t-shirts. They had models in wearing these amazing outfits that are all Motown themed. It's a great place to go for holiday shopping. So from what I can see, you can buy something for anyone on your list. Take a look. Motown is such a significant part of the fabric of the life here in Detroit. The culture is infused in our city's culture. The songs are part of the soundtrack of our lives. Now we have a chance to add a little Motown to our holiday season with some Motown-esque gifts from the Motown gift shop. And joining us is Sheila Spencer, the general manager at the Motown Museum, to tell us more. Thank you for being with us. Thank you for having us. It, We're so excited to be here. It is our pleasure. Now, <laughs> let's talk a little bit about why everyone should be shopping local and especially indulging loved ones with a gift from the Motown Museum. Absolutely. So, you know, we are so proud to be in Detroit and to be part of this great, great city. So to be able to shop locally, have people buy exclusive gifts from Motown Museum, it's unique. Um, the music is unique, it's universal, so we're excited just to be in this space. Anyone would love this. So let's yes. get into some of the items that are available, especially, okay. you know, of course, these Motown-inspired delights, because we've got everything from bags to shirts. So let's start we here do. and go down the line. Yes, yes. So I'm so excited this year. Our 2022 collection um, is our Artist Legacy Collection. So it comes with a great, you get the bag, um, the t-shirt, um, and it's unisex. So it's different artists on there. You can't mm. miss it at all. And we have that amazing Motown mug. When you're cold, you know, you need a little tea and coffee. Yes. We have that as well. And it has the legacy artist on there. And that's such a such must have for the season. Love it. Yeah. And then we have this amazing blanket. It has the artist nice. on there. It's super, super soft. You know, you keep super warm along with our Hicksville USA blanket as well. So you can't miss those great buys. And we've got some hats here, we some do. socks, sweatshirts. I we love all do. of this. So all of this is kind of part of our newer collection with the M label, the M label um, socks as well. And then we have this super soft M label sweatshirt. It's the one you want to wrap up and you want to stay in on the, those cold winter days. Mm -hmm. um, and then we have our label sweatshirt. Of course, our beanies you can't go wrong with. Um, our tumblers, of course, that for those days when you're out at the games. Mm -hmm. And what would Motown be without Motown music? I okay? love it. I love and it. And this box set actually has 11 different CDs in it with all the number one hits. Wow. So you can, yes, yes, it's absolutely amazing. So we have Christmas music, we have albums, and and then, of course, you can't miss that snow one, globe. a snow globe. And ornaments that I saw on your ornaments, website. Ornaments, absolutely. You, there's literally something for everyone, in my for opinion. For everyone, yeah. for everyone, and even our children as I well. I love it. Now, yeah. let's, let's go to our models, okay. and let's talk about what they have on. So we're so excited. This is Carrington and Don. They are actually sporting our new artist legacy collection. So it, they have, it does come in unisex in all sizes. They have that warm fleece to go with it. And then you could team it with our um, scars 
bags that we have at the museum, our tote bag, which the straps come in different colors. Nice. And then we also have that label hat. You can't miss our Motown label mm -hmm. that Don is sporting as well. And we do have that in the M label too. I like it, I like yeah. it. You know what I love about wearing, about anything Detroit themed, and I know you'll be, a hit, no pun intended, if you have something Motown on. When you wear it, you go out of town. Yes. And people are like, what? Where'd you get that right, from? Right, exactly. Like, oh, I'm in Detroit. And right, right. <laughs> the it. pride of I Detroit. Love I love it. <laughs> so where can people get more information, like store hours and a preview of what's Absolutely. available? Absolutely. Just go to our um, website at www.motownmuseum.org. We are in two locations, so we're excited. We have our pop-up shop that's going to mm -hmm. be in Hicksville next. We are have our tours on pause right now until February. So we look for everybody coming back. But in the meantime, come down to Greektown. We're in the heart of Greektown. And we also at our pop-up shop. Hours are 10 to 6 on the West Grand Boulevard area. And we're open a little bit later in Greektown, um, 12 to 8. So okay. we're super excited for the holiday season. Okay, well, this is going to be a hit for whoever you're shopping for. That's all oh, I have to say. Oh, we're good. And also, they, people can also still donate um, to the museum, um, give a gift of Motown. Um, MGM is donating up to to, they are matching up to ten thousand right. um, for anybody to donate till December second. So let's, let's we're so excited. Keep donating, everyone. All Keep right. donating, and thank you Keep all so much for being life. here. Thank you. The models as well. Thank you guys. All right, now it was a different kind of giving. We yes. To talk about. Yeah, I got to talk about giving the gift of an experience. You know, uh, more and more people are doing it nowadays. Where that's a good gift. You can take us to a concert, mm -hmm. or possibly take it, or possibly a membership to the YMCA. There's tons of fun stuff they have to offer. And they talked about why it makes such a good holiday gift. And you know, I would have never thought, oh, something from the YMCA. But this right? is a great idea. Giving experiences as a gift has become more and more popular. And if you're looking for an experience that the entire family can enjoy, our sponsor, the YMCA of Metropolitan Detroit, has a lot to check out. And we are joined by Letitia McCree Thomas, Welcome to the show. Welcome, I'm so glad to be here. Thank you for welcoming me. Now, many people may not be aware of all the programs the Y has to offer our community, so let's go through some of them. Oh my God, so um, we are so fortunate that we have a program called Detroit Swims where we actually teach young people how to swim at no cost. We are very grateful. We actually got a gift from Jay Farner of a million dollars to teach over 1,500 children really? to swim. Uh, we also have uh, programs where we uh, provide food, we have swimming, we have youth and to teach young people about legislature. We have a whole host of programs from basketball. And one of the things that we're really excited about is we um, offer a program, Les Mills Body Pump, and it's included with your membership. Oh. It's a program where um, you can actually uh, build muscle, lift weights, and it's great for um, all ages and all abilities. Nice, so it's not just a gym. So why might someone be interested in a family membership? because it is timeless, genderless, and ageless. From cradle to career through your retirement years, the Y has something for everyone. Well, that's awesome. So what are some of the things that are included with a family membership? Well, one of the things you get is exclusivity. One of the things you get is priority registration. If you guys tried to register kids for summer camp last year, you know they got full. Yes. really quickly. So if you're a member of the Y, you get to register first and you get to save right now um, up to $100 a week on camp when you register now. Interesting. Okay, so speaking of, your summer camp is very popular. Um, is now the time to start thinking about Absolutely. That? Registration is opening right now for summer camp. If you are a member, you can register right now. If you're not a member, you have to wait till December the 3rd. If you're not a member, you save up to $50 a week. So you still get a savings, but not as much as you save when you are a member. When you think about the savings, you might as well become a member because you'll get the membership and the savings. Yes. It's a better deal that way. That's right. So are these day camps then? Or are they overnight? We camps? have summer camps and overnight camps. We have okay. summer camps at over a dozen locations in metropolitan Detroit. We have an overnight camp in Oscoda and Holly, and there are deals going on for all of them right now. Nice. So you get a lot of things with the membership. Oh, right? absolutely. So if someone wanted to perhaps give it as a gift, um, how could they do that? So you see these beautiful little cards we hear. You just go to any of our seven locations and tell them you want to purchase a gift. And these are the things you can purchase. You can tell them I want to buy a family a three month or a six month or a year membership. You can buy personal training. That's a great gift for someone. Ooh. You can buy swim lessons. You can buy. Think of this. Give your niece or nephew a week of summer camp. What an experience. We think experiences are important. And when you give a family um, a membership to the Y, you give them something to do all month long. And when you think about that, 
The value of, like right now, we have something really wonderful. If a family earns less than $49,000 a year, you can get a family membership for $40 a month. Oh, wow. And if you earn over $49,000 a year, less than $3 a day, you can get a YMCA family membership. And so we're making it affordable and accessible because families can swim, they can play basketball, they can do all these things regardless of their age. Like I said, there's something for everyone at the Y. That is very cool. And I will say, I started giving the gift of experiences to my family. And it's been such a unique thing because you're getting memories that literally last a lifetime. That Absolutely. Way. So um, I think you might have already covered this, but are there any other specials or are those the two specials? Well, we have a special Live in a D. Oh, nice. So Live in a D. If you tell people you saw this Live in a D by the end of the day tomorrow, you will get a seven day free trial for the Y membership. Oh, nice. So mention Live Indeed, you can try the Y for free for a week. That's awesome. We, we hook you up here. <laughs> well, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. All right. To learn more about all of the YMCA Metropolitan, the, all of the YMCA of Metropolitan Detroit has to offer, visit the website ymcadetroit.org. Again, that's ymcadetroit.org. And remember, if you mention Live in the D, you receive a free guest pass and can be entered to win a three-month membership. Thanks for hanging out with us in the green room. Michelle and I will be on the show tomorrow. Yes. And on Friday. So That's come right. check us out and join us at 11 a.m.